in this video I'll be showing you how to make flower sunglasses. I know there's a lot of tutorials on how to glue flower embellishments on glasses, but in this video I'll be showing you how to make the embellishments. To make the flowers, you will need baking clay. And the cool thing about this is that you can make it any size you want and any color. When I went to Sephora, I saw a Ciate flower manicure kit and what attracted me most to it were the sunglasses. And I like nail art, but the sunglasses were way better than the nail art in the kit. Let me know what you think in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to watch more fun crafty videos. Thank you so much for watching! You will need some sunglasses any size you want, some Sculpey glaze, E6000 glue, an X-Acto knife, baking clay, and a paintbrush. Here I mix dark purple and white to get a pastel purple. If you want a scarlet pastel, mix a little bit of red with yellow and white. By the way, you can use any baking clay like Sculpey, Primo, or Polymer. To get a light green, I mixed green pearl from Primo with white. You get the idea now. So now that you have all your colors, you can start making your flowers. Use an X-Acto knife to slice off little pieces. Get a little piece of clay and flatten it out between your thumb and your index finger. It doesn't have to be perfect as long as it's flat enough to roll. Now roll the little piece like it's a little taquito. Now that you have this, you can put this down and get another piece of clay and make a flat little petal again. Instead of rolling it, you're going to stick it against where the last fold ends. Keep making little petals and place them against the flower on the opposite side you place the last petal. Keep repeating this step until you reach the desired size you like. As you're placing the petals, you want to fold down the edges to give it a more natural look of a real flower. Use your X-Acto knife to make little dents on the middle of each petal. This will make it more detailed and realistic. As you're rolling and making petals, flip out the edges and add little dents. If you don't want any fingerprints to show on the flowers, you can use fitted latex gloves. When you're done with each flower, use an X-Acto knife to cut the stem off. Roll it against your index finger and slowly slice it to get a nice, even cut edge. A nice flat base will help the flowers stick better to the sunglasses. Now that you have all your flowers made, place them on a piece of foil. I made about 50. Put in the oven for 275 degrees for 10 to 15 minutes. Soak a cotton ball in alcohol and clean the edges of the frame so it's nice and clean. Take your E6000 glue and glue the frame where you're going to place the flowers. I only did one side for now so the other side doesn't dry out. After your flowers are cooled down, now you can place them on the frame where you place the glue. E6000 glue is way stronger than hot glue gun, so I highly recommend for you to use this glue. You can get it at any craft store for just a couple bucks. Finish it off with the flower in the middle. Before you paint the flowers with Sculpey Glaze, make sure the glue has finished drying. When the glue has finished drying, you can wrap those sunglasses and you can say you made them. Comment below if you like to see more clay videos, thumbs up this video, and don't forget to subscribe.